Aquarius, I'm back. What's up, my aqua babies? What it do? Y'all already know what time it is, honey. It's your girl, Life of Pinky, period. Facts. And I am back again with another reason for my aqua gang, my aqua family, my aqua babies, my aqua tribe. Honey, I love y'all so much. Anyway, without further ado, baby, we have to go ahead and jump on into it, baby. We have to find out what's going on, Aquarius, with this love life of yours, honey. Because I know mine is off the chain right now. Look at this. Past life relationship fell out the deck. So, somebody could be dealing with someone from their past or just a past life connection or somebody from their past life is returning. We're about to find out because that fell right in my lap. Spirit, what the messages? Well, what messages do we have for the aquas regarding their love life? What's coming towards my aquas in love? What's coming towards my aquas in love? What is coming towards my aquas in love, spirit? What's coming towards my aquas in love? What's coming towards my aquas in love, spirit? What messages do we have for the aquas regarding their love life? Oh, love yourself first, period. Period. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Aquarius, love yourself or nobody else will. And that's a fact. Okay. I think J. Cole said it. Okay. So, yeah. And it also says keep an open mind, Aquarius. So, I feel like you, you feel like if you're single right now, I feel like you think, you know, love isn't coming your way or you're never going to find your person and da, da 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 you're not if you have that attitude okay i feel like keeping up in mind aquarius your your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectation so it could be someone that you least expect or someone that you're not normally attracted to or someone that you wouldn't normally talk to i feel like this person could be younger than you this person could be older than you this person could be a different race from you i just feel like aquarius keep an open mind try something Okay, it says true love. This is a romance of a lifetime. So there's definitely true love coming towards you, Aquarius. But you need to love yourself first. Pour into yourself first. Date yourself, okay? Don't be so engulfed into someone else where you can't pay attention to your wants and your needs and your thoughts, okay? And your opinions and your ideas. Look at this. Let go of control issues, Aquarius. And y'all know we some controlling motherfuckers. So yeah, definitely let go of control issues, honey. Allow the situation to unfold naturally is what it says. So yeah, don't be so engulfed into someone else. Don't be so quick to rush into something. Love yourself first and true love will follow. Okay. And there may be even babies. Okay. Because there's two kids. There's a kid in this car and there's a kid in this car. I feel like this could be Cupid. <clears throat> and this is when you and your person meet or you guys met or they're just so you know completely attracted to you because you pour all of this love into yourself you're glowing you're radiant aquarius male or female it does not matter i feel like this person shot you know this this person cupid shot this person honey and as soon as they saw you was like oh my god love at first sight you're my one true love and i want to be with you and i want to just oh my god you see there's a <laughs> there's a kid behind them in this one so you two can have kids together you're gonna have a child together boy or girl Take what resonates. It says make the effort. And then there's kids in this card. So I don't know. Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take Aquarius. So you're being guided. Excuse me. You're being guided to let this love take its course. Let it, you know, go the way it's going. Don't try to change anything. Don't try to alter anything. Definitely don't change yourself for this shit. Because if this person, if this is true love, this person is going to love you for who you are. Okay. Period. It could also be someone else. Like a third party or something that could like be throwing you off i feel like keep an open mind though aquarius i keep hearing keep an open mind don't let that shit hold you back from finding your husband or your wife okay period religious factors so there's um your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path so i feel like your spiritual path could either guide you towards your person or guide you away from someone that you don't need to be with at all i feel like your intuition and your spirit is telling you deep down inside you know what to do um but you just need some guidance, Aquarius, and that's okay. And this past life relationship keeps showing up. So there's definitely a past life connection that's redeveloping. It says you have known each other before. So there's someone returning for love as well. Spirit, what other messages do we have for Aquarius regarding their love life? New love. Ooh. So this person could either be coming back in new love energy or just coming back in some type of new energy. Or they... um. They have you feeling these new things about them. Maybe you guys were friends at first and now, you know, they're coming back and they're kind of looking at you like, ooh. And you kind of look at them like, ooh. 
and then y'all kind of like ooh together okay period new love release your ex aquarius release your ex okay let it go let it go let it go okay period the time has come to clear your energy aquarius it's time to release your ex i feel like you're holding on to either this relationship or what this relationship did to you this with your ex and i feel like that's you know causing you to not even want to move forward with anybody new Spirit, what other messages do we have for the Aquas? What other messages do we have for the Aquarius regarding their love life? It just got hot in here out of nowhere. So someone makes you hot, Aquarius. It just got hot in here. Spirit, what other messages do we have for the Aquas? That's too many. It was four. Spirit, Spirit what other messages children yep i told you your love life is being affected by children so either you two are going to have children someone is pregnant somebody's going to find out about a child that's going to destroy a relationship or um you're going to find out that you're pregnant aquarius and it says very soon so either you're going to find out you're pregnant or you already have children with this person this could be your ex that you need to release that you have children with as well um or you two have talked about having children together you and this new love or you're going to if you haven't met them already, it says very soon though, Aquarius. <coughs> Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Spirit, give me one more message for the Aquas regarding their love life. Retreat. Mm. And they're in wedding clothes. So this could be someone going on their honeymoon or you're just going on some type of romantic getaway. It's time to disconnect from the world. I feel like you and this person um, definitely may be going out of town or on some type of trip or on some type of, you know, romantic retreat. <laughs> Where it's just me and you. <laughs> Aquas. This is so cute. Oh my goodness. So I feel like you two are just going to shut the world out. I feel like this is how you two feel when you're together. There's nobody else around. There's nobody else in the room. It's just you and me. It's just me and you. <laughs> Aquas, y'all so cute. At the bottom of the deck, it says free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. So release control issues, Aquarius, but definitely control your life. Control what you can control. Do not try to control things that are out of your control, Aquarius. If you can't control it, that means it ain't for you. Okay? Facts. Only control what you're, you know, able to control, what you're capable of controlling. We're going to get some messages of love. What messages do we have for the Aquas regarding this situation? messages do we have for my aquas boundaries firm boundaries are needed now Aquarius definitely set some firm boundaries I feel like you um go into relationships or situations where your boundaries are not you know set in stone I feel like you say one thing but then they do something and you're like okay you know and once you let a nigga uh ice skate they gonna they gonna goddamn figure skate okay once you let a nigga skate they gonna start skating on your top okay period but look at this true love again aquarius it's definitely time to set some boundaries especially if you want to find or, or this is your true love it's definitely time to set some boundaries true love is here twice this love is emotional physical and unconditional aquarius so definitely boundaries are definitely needed please let this person know i did see heart to heart conversations come out please let this person know how you feel and that's as i was saying please let this person know how you feel be open and honest about what it is that you want so that they can you know let you know if that's if they're okay with meeting those boundaries okay vulnerability aquarius is definitely okay to be completely open with this person warning though warning don't dismiss the red flags here okay so there's still some red flags um this person may be hiding something from you aquarius oh but true love still came out mm, mm, mm. so this is definitely your true love aquarius um, I just feel like be open, be honest, be completely open with this person. Let this person know how you feel. Don't hold all that shit in. It says integrity at the bottom of the deck. Does this situation align with your values and morals? So, yeah, it may be true love, but is it the true love that you're looking for? Okay? Does it align with what you, you know, are aligned with at this time? Are you too aligned? Are you too equally yoked? Because if not, it's not going to work. Spirit, what other messages do we have for the Aquarius? okay that's too many we'll take this one it says time apart some distance will help bring clarity so there could definitely be some distance between you and your true love now you and this person um you and this new love or um putting distance creating this distance between you two message message creating distance between you two could definitely help you know bring you some type of clarity help you understand exactly what it is that you want from this situation um so that you can be completely open and honest about it 
about the boundaries that you're setting here. It says trust at the bottom of the deck. Trust, Aquarius. It's time to have trust. It's okay to trust. It's safe to trust in this situation. Everything is happening the way it's supposed to happen. Divine timing, divine intervention, divine protection. Everything is happening divinely. Happening divinely. Yeah, look at this. Protected. You are safe and divinely guided. Everything is happen divine, happening divinely, Aquarius. So, yeah, definitely trust in this situation. It's okay. Decision, though, at the, at the end of the day, it's still time to decide about this relationship. So, if this is what you truly want, you know, let this person know so that they can let you know what it is that they want. And if they're not on the same page, and it's okay. Then that's not your true love. Okay? Or maybe they feel like you two just need some space. I don't know. Or maybe this is how you feel, Aquarius. Spirit, what the message is? Okay. It says strictly sexual. This is going down on top of a retreat. I feel like um, it says this connection is passionate but not enduring. So there could be... Um, this could be like a situation ship or like an entanglement. You're not really, you know, in love or you're not really, you know, you're not really there yet. It's just strictly sexual. It's only, you know, sex. But with sex comes feelings, comes emotions. Y'all know that. Male or female. Uh, men get attached and women get attached. It's okay. Okay. Integrity. So does this situation align with your values and morals? Do you want to be just a booty call for the rest of you in this person's life? You know, do you want to just be the, you know, the fun girl, the fun boy? Okay? Does this align with your morals and values? Is this something that you, you know, can see yourself doing for the rest of your life? Or do you want to be a husband? Do you want to be a wife? You know, set them boundaries of where if all you wanted to do was have sex with this person in the beginning, then that's fine. But if you want something more, let this person know that so they can let you know what they want. But I feel like what's crazy, Aquarius, is they're in this strictly sexual situation because that's what you wanted. That's what you, you know, put out. You may not have said like, okay, we just gonna, you know, be, you know, fuck buddies. We just gonna, we not gonna, you know, we not gonna go there. Okay. I ain't trying to be involved. I ain't trying to woo woo. And then you started catching feelings. But what you don't know is this person has those same feelings. This person feels the exact same way. I feel like you just need to say something so that they can know what page you're on. I'm going to need you to say something, baby. Okay, period. Look at this. You speak to me through music. I couldn't figure out why the fuck I kept singing. I keep singing. You speak to this person through music, Aquarius. So, yeah. Say something to this person. I feel like let this person know. Like, if you're, you, you don't caught feelings, say that. So, they can let you know if they've caught feelings as well. They have... They have Aquarius. They've always cared. They've always cared, Aquarius. Look, I'm grateful for the spiritual lesson. So I feel like this situation is teaching them some type of spiritual lesson. Some type of... It's teaching them more about you. Like, they're able to see a different side of you. Like, it's like, okay, maybe, you know, you two were in a relationship before. And then now you're just like, okay, we could just, you know, we don't have to be in a relationship. We don't have to try it again. We could just have sex, da 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 And I feel like now they're seeing a different side of you. And it's, it's teaching them a lesson. A very spiritual, very powerful lesson. Look, I replay our conversations over and over. They're trying to figure out where the fuck they went wrong. They're trying to figure out, well, what did the Aquarius... Did she, did she say or did he say he wanted or did she say she wanted to do this did they say they wanted to do that like they're literally replaying this conversation over in their head because they can't get over whatever the fuck you done said to them spirit what the messages do we have for the aquarius so you two could definitely be um at a distance right now it says i know that i crossed the line with you so yeah I feel like if you weren't in a relationship and it started off as just fuck buddies, they know that they've crossed that line. They know that they're in relationship territory now. They know they're in the in the danger zone. Okay? So now they're trying to figure out if, if you're there too. But it says, I couldn't let you get close to me at the bottom of the deck. So, of course, I feel like they were scared. So, because they didn't know how you felt. Because you never told them how you truly felt. So, they felt like, okay, well, if the Aquarius is not going to let me get close to them, then, baby, I can't let you get close to me. Period. Spirit. What other messages do we have for the Aquas? Oh my God. Oh my God. They talking. I love you unconditionally. I told you they felt the same way, Aquarius. And it's going down on true love. This love is emotional, physical, and unconditional. I love you unconditionally, Aquarius. But what's crazy is I feel like there are some conditions. At the bottom of the deck, it says, I wonder if you are happy without me. So there could be some distance, some time apart that you guys decided to take. You know, you had to take a break because a couple of y'all caught feelings. 
So you have to take a break. And now they're trying to figure out, like, I wonder if the Aquarius is really happy without me. I wish things could be different. I knew exactly what I was doing. Yeah, they knew they was getting you all caught up in their bullshit. Oh, caught up in their web. They knew that. I love you, Aquarius. I love you unconditionally. I love you. We will be together again. They're not playing with you, Aquarius. They're not playing. I hid who I really am from you. Yeah. They hid the fact that they really wanted to be in a relationship, but because you said you wanted something strictly sexual, no strings attached, that's what they went along with. But it says they knew what they were doing. I know I crossed that line with you. I knew what I was doing, and I hid who I really am from you so you wouldn't, you know, get suspicious. I bury myself and work to forget you. So now they're trying to forget you, but they can't. They cannot. And since we saw you speak to me through music, we're going to get some music messages. And then we're going to close it out. Spirit, what? Oh, Lord. What messages are coming through for my aquas? Which songs are coming through for my Aquarius? Which songs are coming through for my aquas? Yeah, I said it. Yeah, I said it. The Aquarius said, yeah, I said it, motherfucker. And at the bottom of the deck, we got off of you. So I feel like, Aquarius, maybe you pulled away from the situation because it kind of felt like they were only wanting to continue to be strictly sexual. Like, maybe you did speak up. Maybe you did let this person know. And now it's kind of like, okay, I'm off of you, period. Off of you. Yeah, I said, I'm off you. Yeah, you don't know my body. I'm off you, baby. What the songs do we have for the aquas? Ooh. I'll make love to you like you want me to. And I'll hold you tight, baby, all through the night. I'll make love to you <laughs> when you want me to. And I will not let go so you tell me to. Okay, period, Aquarius. I said they may love you how you want them to. And I ain't gonna let you go. At the bottom of the deck, we got Jacquees. Bed. Okay, B-E-D. Okay, period. They wanna get you in that bed, though. They definitely wanna get you in that bed. They definitely trying to make some love to you. They tired of fucking. They wanna make love. Ooh, unforgiving. I feel like they're telling me to play that song, but look what's still at the bottom of the deck. <laughs> they still want to get you in that bed. I feel like they're definitely telling me to play that song. Hey Siri, play Unforgiven by Young Blue. Hey Siri, play Unforgiving by Young Blue. Here's Unforgiving by Blue and Navy Hill on Apple Music. Spirit, what the messages do we have for the Aquarius? Oh, Destiny's Child, say my name. And then we got The Weekend by SZA. So, yeah, maybe y'all can only connect on the weekend and y'all only connect on the weekends. Back when we were young, we had the world in our hands. At the bottom of the deck, Girls Need Love featuring Drake. Okay, facts. Here, give me one more. You just didn't understand that I'm so unforgiving. She want to leave. He said she ain't got no more feelings. She ain't got no more feelings. She want to leave. I fucked the best friend. Yeah, I made it easy. Okay, maybe did nobody fuck your best friend, but they fucked you over. It's, it's, it's giving, you feel like they fucked you over, Aquarius. So you're not forgiving. You're not forgiving them this easily. Maybe they didn't fuck your friend. Maybe they didn't fuck nobody. I feel like they just kind of fucked you over. So you're giving me one more for the aquas. Ooh, way more clothes. Hey Siri, play Way More Close by Young Blue. And at the bottom of the deck, we got Beyonce, mine. Facts. Way more close to you. Mm, featuring Big Sean. So, yeah, period, Aquas. Way more close to you, and they're definitely. Hey Siri, play mine by Beyonce. Fuck what you heard in my own mind. Okay, period. And then Sierra's prayer is up under that. That's crazy. And bad and bougie. And I was talking about bad and bougie today, y'all. That's ironic. Took a trip to clear my mind. Mm. 
Now I seem more lost than used to so fine. Oh my, oh my. Been having conversations about breakup and separations. I'm not feeling like myself since the baby. Are we gonna even make it up? Cause if we are, you're taking this a little too far. Baby, if we are, you're taking this a little too far. Me being wherever I'm at, worry about wherever you are. You're taking this a little too far. Okay, period. Of course, I love you guys so much. I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. Thank you so much for watching, honey. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. My camera finna die. Click the notification bell, all that good jazz. And I'll see y'all in the next one, baby. I love y'all. Peace, love, and light. Peace out.